Hey everybody and welcome back. Man, we haven't been fishing for so long that I'm pretty sure I'm starting to lose vision out of my left knee. Uh, I saw that on Facebook today and I couldn't resist. It pretty much sums up my fishing lately. But all kidding aside, it has been a while since we've done any fishing. It's probably been a couple weeks. We, uh, for the month of September, we've pretty much been either traveling for work or traveling for personal. And it uh, just hasn't been any time to fish, so... We've been kind of looking forward to getting back out here and, and doing a little fishing. And when I mean a little fishing, this is just going to be a little fishing. We're going to just come out to Overall Creek over here uh, behind our subdivision. Last couple of times we came out here, there was uh, little to no water in pretty much the entire creek. But uh, with Hurricane Helene coming through, looks like it's filled up the creek pretty good. And it's nice and slow, so well, we're just going to try a couple things. See if we can catch some long ear sunfish or some bluegill. Um, all in all, just kind of see what's biting. So let's get onto the creek and do some fishing. The creek is nice and clear. Thought it might be more like chocolate milk after all that rain we got. Let's just try floating something. Fish. Oh jeez. I think it's a good fish. It is a good fish. Here's my first bass out of Overall Creek. There you go. Nice looking little largemouth bass. Good looking guy. First one out of Overall Creek. See ya, bud. So I actually caught that guy on one of these little um, ugly stick dock runners. And these are little 36 inch poles. Um, but with a name like ugly stick, you can't go wrong. And heck, it just reeled in a bass, so I can't complain about that. But anyway, they're, they're pretty cheap. But they're good for just coming out to the creek and throwing in a line. Let's do it again. All right, we're going to move downstream a little bit. Not a whole lot biting there except for that one, uh, one bass, which is fantastic, by the way. Never caught a bass out here. I've heard they're in here. Uh, but I think the only thing we've ever caught out of here are pretty much chubs, uh, bluegill, and long ear sunfish. So that was definitely a welcome uh, visitor, welcome biter, I guess. So let's go down here, see if we can find another spot. And here we do. Here's another spot.
fish. Oh, fish gone. There we go. It's another bass. Look at that. Hang on, buddy. Just gonna get your picture. Look at that. Another little bass. Two bass today. See you, bud. fish <laughs> and it's another bass this might be the same fish stick I caught last time well maybe he might even be smaller all right well thanks for playing see you bud This is turning out to be a very unexpectedly fun day of catching only bass in my neighborhood. Who would have ever thunk? Oh, that's not sounding good. There we go. <laughs> Another bass. Open up. There. Another little fish stick. See you, bud. This has got bad news written all over it, but we'll give it a try. By the way, I found out that there is actually another Dad's Fishing Adventures out on YouTube. Looks to be a pretty new site, and his site is actually called Dad's Fish Ish Ing Adventures with an extra ish. Um, probably going to cause some confusion, but at least we're the the OG of of Dad's Fishing Adventures. Looks like an alright site. Let's let's give this one a few casts. Well, of course I wasn't recording, but I caught another little fish stick, and he's going to go right into the water. See you, bud. That could be number six. It is number six. Oh, and he got off. There's another bass.
Oh, there's our six fish. And it is the littlest bass yet. Well, that's gonna do it for today. That was a lot of fun. I think we ended up catching about six or seven bass. Nothing much bigger than a fish stick, but it's not every day you can go fishing in your backyard, bass fishing in your backyard. Um, again, those are the first bass I've ever caught back here. Usually it's sunfish and the occasional bluegill. So didn't even catch any of those today. So that was a lot of fun. All right, well, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And as always, even if you didn't enjoy this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and tune in next time for another episode of Dad's Fishing Adventures, the OG Dad's Fishing Adventures. Thanks, everybody.